have your design ready to go, what you're going to do is you're going to go to File. You're going to say Export, not Save. You're going to say Export As. You're going to get this window here. Remember, you can increase your window size here if you want to. I'm going to save it to my desktop for now. So I'm going to click on Desktop. Uh, I can't even find the desktop. There it is. Sorry. Tiny little print. Uh, I am going to change the format. Uh, you can use a PNG if you like, but I'm just going to use a JPEG for now. Uh, and then I'm going to use my artboards. Remember that using artboards gives you that white border. If I did not use the artboard button, it would just pump out the artwork of whatever size the artwork is. But I want it to be this 8.5 by 11. So I'm going to click that button that says use artboards. I'm going to say export. And then here, uh, by default, it's going to say RGB, which is the color scheme for J uh, JPEG by default. Uh, when we print stuff, we would normally use a CMYK. At this level of what we're doing, it's not that important to do uh, that. Right now, if RGB is fine, so I want to make sure it's color. And then quality, I'm just going to say high quality. And then resolution down here at the bottom, I'm going to pump that resolution up to 300 pixels per inch because I want it to be the best resolution that it can be. Uh, don't worry about all that other stuff. I'm going to say OK. And I can see it just appeared here on my desktop, so if I quit Illustrator... I have a little JPEG right here, and that's my final piece. Then that piece, you are going to save into your Google Drive, right? So you're going to log into Google Drive and save it. And then from there, you're going to capture it onto the rubric in Schoology, bring it to Notability, push it into there, and then you're also going to set it into the media album.